the former champion of Mortal Kombat and member of the White Lotus Society. Liu Kang was murdered by Shang Tsung. He now exists as a living corpse, fueled by vengeance. Liu Kang was Earthrealm's best hope at preventing Shao Kahn from taking over. After defending Earthrealm for many years against the forces of evil, Liu Kang was eventually killed by the Deadly Alliance, which was Quan Chi and Shang Tsung. Liu Kang has always been the ultimate hero in Mortal Kombat. He's been kind of like the, the common man character throughout the whole series. We don't give him the crazy violent moves. He's a Shaolin monk. You know, we really wanted to make him the character that was the hero of the game. So we did that for a number of titles, and finally we really wanted to kind of change things up. At this point, uh, Liu Kang exists in two forms. He's an undead corpse, and he's also his spirit self. <laughs> You know, Liu Kang was designed to be the most accessible Mortal Kombat character. You know, his moves are the simplest to perform, toward towards, high punch, toward towards, high kick. So he had these really cool flying kicks and fireballs, and anybody can perform them because the combination was so easy to do. And so our idea with Liu Kang was always to make that the most accessible character that, you know, you can basically show your mom how to play Mortal Kombat using Liu Kang. Finish him!